Hey guys, Draco here, and today I'm going to be going over how to get all legendary schematics in Power World. So, I got a list here. Most of them come from world bosses, but you can also get them from chests and dungeons. I'm going to show you some clips after of some that I've gotten. But here's the list here. We're going to go through it real quick. So, legendary old bow comes from King Paka. Legendary crossbow comes from Bushi. Legendary handgun comes from Beacon. These are all alphas, by the way. You gotta go and find the boss version of them and beat them. Legendary pump action shotgun is from Suzaku. Legendary assault rifle is from Blazament. Legendary rocket launcher is from Jetrigan. And then the armors are legendary cloth outfit from Chillip. Legendary feathered hair band from Pen King. Legendary Pelt Armor from Azor. Legendary Metal Helm from Morsec. Legendary Metal Armor from Elizabeth. Legendary Refined Metal Helmet from Menesting. Legendary Heat Resistant Refined Metal Armor from Astagon. Legendary Cold Resistant Refined Metal Armor from Lilene Nock. Legendary Heat Resistant Pal Armor from Necromus. Legendary Cold Resistant Pal Armor from Pal Paldeus, and Legendary Pal Metal Helmet from Frostallion. Okay, next I'm going to get into the accessories and where you get those. So stick with me. Hold on a sec. In order to get the accessories, you plus two on them, like the Heat Resistant T shirt and the Cold Resistant T shirt, and the plus two to defense, and plus two to attack. You're gonna have to come to the winter area in the west northwestern part of the map. Uh, you'll find Frost Stallion on this part of the map. And there's several caves all through the area. They're level 45. I believe they're called Sacred Mountain. Uh, when you come inside, there's gonna be two chests at the end and an alpha. Uh, after you beat the alpha, at the end there's going to be two chests. Inside there's going to be accessories, hopefully. Or it could be skill point books. Or it could be gems for gold. But either way, it's definitely worth doing. Even if it's just for the alpha. Next up I'm going to show you where I got my gold resistant refined metal armor from. So I killed Lylee Nock, and I got the schematic from her after she died. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this content. And there's a tip down below in the description if you want to support me directly. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.